Well, it you considered what you actually wanted in your installation, and you figured out you wanted something completely different. You don't have to uninstall and reinstall it. Or just reinstall. One installation doesn't really do anything. Um, it, it's fairly easy. I'm just going to go log in as root. And, uh, let's see. Ooh, wait. We just installed it. And it told us in the installer that we should use our mail command. Oh, cool, that's a big line of text. Oh, I'll read it later. You should read it now. Pause the video, come back to it. Uh, you... <sighs> Alright, let's say we wanted an SSH server. Well, we don't have one. The if config utility allows us to know the IP of our machine. Right here, it's 10.0.2.15. The ping command allows us to see if a server is there. Like, for example, google.com, you can ping that. It'll tell you it transmitted two packets, received both, so zero packet loss. That means you can go to it, it'll give you something back, so it's there. The ping utility exists on Unix so that you can see if the server exists. If somebody pings you, you your machine will sit pong back where they say that they do indeed exist. And that's this true for all Unix machines. That's how the internet works. You gotta share. And that's true for many, many other utilities. The SSH utility is an example of that. Let's see if we even have our computer connected to the internet. Doesn't look like we do. On Linux, the command is IPA to find out if you have any, to find out your internet address. Well, let's see if we can get to the computer the other way. connected to the internet <sighs> no okay that was a good first test now now we figured out a problem with getting SSH we gotta have it connected to the internet SSH is a utility so that you can connect to another computer with a password and use a terminal on that computer. It requires an internet connection. You can use your mobile data or whatever to get to it, but at some point in the chain, an internet connection is usually required. We don't have one. <coughs> Well, let's get one. We want to use the EM0 
to get our internet. The if config utility can be used not only for um, figuring out what internet is available, but also for getting internet. 